Good morning, my dear friends. As I said, today we're going to do some exercises for the core and general stability. For Mitsuyo, since uh, Mitsuyo said that's uh, kind of difficult to stand in one leg and then to move the rest of the body. So let's see how it's going to be our body to perform this kind of activities, this kind of exercises. So, uh, to begin with, we're going to do some warm-up. I would like to have my feet shoulder width distance. The pelvis to be a little bit tilt, forward, rotate forward, so the body is straight, the abdominal muscle relaxed, and the breathing abdominal. So I'm just going to start rotating my arms forward. As I rotate my arms, I have to lift them and then just relax them. Always grip abdominally and keep the attention towards the abdominal muscles. They should be relaxed. Movement is very soft, cut and soft. And we'll do the same thing backward. So as I said, I lift my arms, then by relaxing them, I will lower them down. Try to be completely relaxed as the arms are done. Grip abdominally and keep a straight posture. To be very stable, we're going to work also on the foot level. The foot should be extended and fully gripped on the floor. Now relax your arms, turn the body and Swing the arms around the body. Focus on relaxation, focus on relaxing the abdominal muscles, focus on breathing. Next, we're going to stretch the neck muscles. So start by bending the head forward and backward. Allow your head to sink under its own weight. And now sideways. Stretch very well the side here. As I said, allow the head to lower under its own weight. Do not control the movement. And focus the attention on the abdominal muscle. They should be relaxed. Next, I'm going to bend sideways. Allow your body to stretch completely. You should feel the stretch going down below the knee on the rear leg muscles. Relax your feet. Come back with the hands on the waist. Rotate your waist and relax your legs. Soften your legs from ankle, ankles, knees, and hips. Very soft. And the feet are well gripped onto the floor. Relax the abdominal muscles. Relax the back. Allow the spine to move freely.
Relax the shoulders, relax the chest, the upper back, the abdominals, the lower back, the hips, the thighs, lower leg, ankles and feet. Very well. Now we will start with the first exercise. You see, in order to be very stable, we should stretch our body and especially the abdominal should be stretched so they will not pull our body forward. When pulling the body forward, automatically we lose our balance. So first exercise to stretch the abdominal body, which is very easy. I'm going to use a simple stick. And here, I'm going to lower the stick backward. So you see? Very simple. I'll keep my back straight. I'll do 10 repetitions, then I'll stop with the skip. And the next exercise is called the lock. I will go beside the wall and then I will bend my back, keeping the legs straight, then try to reach for the wall and try to advance or to descend backward. So as I'm here beside the wall, I don't know if you can see me. I will try to walk my hands down. So let's see if I'm here, you can see me from the side. Something like that. So uh, I will do 10 repetitions like that. Don't force yourself too much. It's enough if you can touch the wall and eventually bring one hand low, down. So. As we do this exercise, try to relax the abdominal muscles, to breathe. Let's do a few more repetitions. Very good, relax. If you have some tea or water, please drink.